Oh man, Proto Man, he betrayed us. This is uh not the first game Proto Man shows up in, right? This is just the second or third game. This is the second game he shows up in. He he originally appears on in uh Mega Man Three, and he's a fucking bastard now. Hey, what's up, everybody? This is the first episode of what is probably going to be uh a, the Mega Boys. A, yeah. The Mega Boys. My 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 New Year's resolution is to play every important Mega Man game. Uh, I I kind of I sort of grew up with Mega Man. Uh, I'm I, oh yeah, I'm with my brother who did grow up with Mega Man. Actually, you're gonna you're gonna tell me how to how the fuck to play these games. Show me the ropes. And uh, we might take turns every now and then uh, with certain games, but at least for the main series ones, uh, I'll be playing all of them and trying to get actually decent at the game. Um, we'll see how that fucking goes, uh, and if I give up, um, because Mega Man is famously kind of hard. You know, this is like the original series I got into as a kid. Uh, not really, not really the original Mega Man at first. I was into Mega Man X. I've, I've been playing that since I was like five years old, whenever mm -hmm. it came out, basically. Right. Uh, Dad just randomly came home with it one day, and yeah, I fell in love with the game. So, it was really, really tough for me, but, uh, yeah, I just uh, really loved the the world and the characters, so I kept playing and playing it and playing it, even though I was five, you know. And uh, yeah, I think that's what really got me into games in general is this series. But actually, this might be surprising to you, Dan. I I didn't really play the uh, original NES games till I was about eleven or twelve. I actually first played them uh, on the Legacy Collection for the GameCube. And, oh uh, yeah, it. yeah. I bought it during a summer, uh, and I stayed over our grandmother's house the whole summer and basically played through all of them. Before that, though, I played Mega Man 7 on the Super Nintendo. I rented it, and uh, I was really confused by Mega Man 7 because, you know, I played Mega Man X, then played mm -hmm. Mega Man X2, X3, right. and all of a sudden Mega Man 7 was there. Right. Was like, Holy shit. You know, they got rid of the X, and now they have seven? <laughs> okay. So I played that game, and I was like, whoa, what, what is going on here? You know, the character looks different, and oh, who's this base guy, you know? I was just, yeah, so confused by, by Mega Man 7 as a kid. But I was, like, in all of it. I was, like, I was playing the future of Mega Man somehow. Like, this <laughs> rental store had seven of, you know? We it's don't like, even have four yet. Found out much later on that there was a whole another Mega Man that I didn't know about. So anyway, I think this is the very first original Mega Man game I, I beat. So that's why so. we're starting with this one? Yeah, I think, well, generally this one... Uh, um, Considered it's easier? It's very beginner friendly. Ah. Beginner friendly. It's not the easiest one. I think the easiest uh, classic series Mega Man is probably Mega Man 6. But, uh, I think this one, yeah, it just gives you a, a good, uh, it's kind of a good warm-up, I think, for the series. Okay, yeah. Uh, I think that's fair, too. I mean, I initially wanted to do this all in release order, um, but, uh, Mega Man 1 is really hard. Oh, I guess I should probably mention, uh, my experience with Mega Man. Um, so I have beaten, I beat Mega Man 2 while I was in high school. Uh, and I only ever beat Mega Man 2. I did beat Mega Man X, the first one, on, um, on the, uh, Mega Man X Legacy Collection for PS2. Um, so I was playing with a shitty controller. But, I did beat it. And outside of that, I've played and finished Mega Man Zero and ZX. Hey guys, it's me. I just, I just stopped time. I, I used my time stopper ability... I am Flashman. Whenever you hear this sound and whenever you hear my voice really close to a microphone like this, that means um, that uh, there's something that I feel like needs to be elaborated on or that I feel like uh, just not enough is being conveyed. Um, so I'll do this sound effect. Uh, you'll begin to hear me talking. Yeah, and uh, so there's a couple things that I want to go ahead and get off uh, because I, I want to make this like sort of a, a knowledge base series in a way like half and half gameplay half and half like facts and stuff um so uh right off the bat this is Mega Man 5 or Rockman 5 Blues No Wana or Blues is Trap uh 
I guess. So, you know, in wanting to establish a series of Mega Man and talking about Mega Man, I somehow managed to fail to talk about Mega Man 5. Um, and I hope in the future to be a slight bit more researched going in. Not in, like, the game itself, but rather, like, what a kid in the 90s might understand if they glanced at a manual before putting the cartridge in. In Japan uh, and in America, North America, uh, the manuals uh, have blurbs, like little blurbs about the story just leading up to you starting the game. Um, so uh, this, this game is no different. Uh, we're going to quickly summarize and go through what just led up to all this shit happening. So 5 is the introduction of Beat, uh, who is Mega Man's ally. He's that bird over on the side. Uh, he's actually, uh, in the manual, it's, it's explained he's made by Dr. Cossack uh, from Mega Man 4, uh, which is pretty cool. I don't think either of us uh, knew about this uh, in this game uh, at this current point in time. Um, so we might just misspeak and get the history wrong uh, at some point, I think. Um, but whatever, I'm doing this right now, so it, it's fine. I know. I know that beat is Dr. Cossack's. Uh, but also noteworthy, though, uh, is that the English manual uh, implies uh, that the Mega Buster Charge upgrade... The, the Mega Buster Charge was in Mega Man 4, but uh, it's a little bit faster in this game. It's it's implied that that improvement might have been done by Dr. Cossack as well. The story begins with Mega Man uh, going to Cossack's uh, to retrieve Beat because he had just completed him, I think. And he is immediately called back to Light's base because, you know, eight new robot masters that are potentially helmed by Proto Man and stuff. Uh, and Proto Man is Mega Man's brother. As we see uh, from the intro of the game, uh, we start out like right after this uh, and Proto Man is like in the process of kidnapping Light, uh, which is kind of fucked up. I mean, the dude's like really old. I don't I don't really think he could take that kind of shit. Anyways, that's basically it. Um enjoy the rest of the video. I'll uh, I'll see you when I see you. We're going uh Charge Man. Charge Man? Yeah. Damn, all right. Fine with me. Hey, uh, it's me again. I stopped time. So, uh we're going to quickly talk about Charge Man uh and his lore. Uh Charge Man uh is Obviously, a uh, steam locomotive. He is a train, which is the first sign that uh, Wily is running out of money. Interestingly enough, like his train appearance, he is powered by coal and water. His sole purpose in life uh, is to seem like a train and make shipments to Dr. Wily-owned areas. He's he's just a train. He's, he's cool, I guess. Apparently, uh, he dislikes trendy fashions and katakana. Um, I don't know what that's about. It's said that he is, he has a one-track mind as well. Um, poor, poor Charge Man. God damn. This Mega Man is like the start of the, uh, cool, uh, charge shot. Charge that up. Oh, charge shit. Up charge shot's in this? Oh! Yeah. Wait, so it starts in this one? No, 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 it actually starts in the fourth game, but, oh. you know, that huge charge shot that you just saw. Yeah, the first time you ever... Uh, Mega Man ever could use that was on this game. Oh, fuck. Oh, you can also slide. Oh, yeah, that's right. A and down. This is like the beloved video game series of my life. You know, whoa, I went whoa, through whoa. different phases with uh, with games and uh, probably this is the only series that I've consistently played since I was a, basically a baby, you know. I pretty much only played Mega Man X, you know. We didn't have that many games. We had like Mario and Street Fighter, a few things, and by far I thought, wow, Mega Man is the coolest, you know? The music, the world, uh, uh, oh, I like damn. the difficulty of it as well. And yeah, it just never, it never frustrated me as a kid. Despite it being pretty tough, you know, for a five-year-old. But, uh, yeah, my... I never really played these original NES games until I was much older. Uh, we did have an NES, but I didn't know the of the existence of the classic series of Mega Man. Damn. Yeah, you want to be more cautious, man. You want to be more <laughs> de deliberate. Uh, you can get that, actually, right now. Yeah, I have a rush coil. Oh, what the fuck? What? You gotta jump, too. Ah. Uh. Bro! 
<laughs> why don't you, why don't you go right under it? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> kind of the funny thing about the charge shot is, uh, you know, I don't think it actually makes the games any easier at all. Mm. And what I mean by that is, uh, like, if you have the charge shot, you're always thinking about using it, right? And so it adds like another thing to think about while you're fighting the bosses. And, uh, you know, if you just had the regular shot, you're just focusing on dodging and shooting, right? Mm -hmm. But with the charge shot, you have to think about charging, shooting, and then, you know, appropriate time to use the charge shot and not miss. So it adds, it adds some more dimensions, I guess. Uh, basically, every single one of these games, I've uh, I've beaten the X series games up until X seven, whenever it transitioned to three D. Mm -hmm. You know, not that I'm against three D. I just uh, I don't know. It was a weird a weird phase for me, I guess. You know, I wasn't right. ready for Mega Man to to go to the th go to the 3d route you know i liked i liked x6 even though x6 is not very uh doesn't have a great reputation mega man and mega man x i've beaten all the robot masters with just the buster by alone you know oh Which is yeah definitely um, not something i think i could probably do not especially not at this level <laughs> i recommend just clearing the game you know the the original way first i've been playing it for 25 years before i tried it I mean, I don't think it takes 25 years to get good enough to uh, beat it Buster only, but... Why did I know, do that backwards? As a kid, the the thought of, oh my god, fighting all the Robot Masters with only the Buster, that's scary as hell, you know? What, what are you trying to do here? I don't know. Okay. Why did I? Oh, my god. <laughs> all right. Now's the situation with this guy. All right, so you can shoot his missiles. So, yeah, focus on shooting his missiles and then hitting him. Okay. <laughs> All right. So through this door is probably my first boss, and I'm most likely gonna die. Uh, One thing you need to do is char charge before you get. In the door. <laughs> I don't even know what he can do. I don't even know what his attack is. Hey, what the hell, man? All right. So he's gonna be uh, charging at you. So you gotta jump. Not now. But when? <laughs> You'll see him kind of rev up and uh, get ready to charge. So. So can't... I can't hit him when he's dark red for yeah. some reason. When he's dark red, don't even try. Jump. I can't hit him whenever he's charging either. Yeah. So only whenever he's just walking. What the fuck? Ah. Uh... You gotta be ready to jump at all times. What the hell, man? Dude, fuck off! <laughs> just, ju just charge! Look at that! Ah, fucking asshole! Yeah, go, 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 go! You yeah. can do it. Ah! Uh. Hey, what the hell? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> what the hell, man? Okay, maybe we should try Gravity Man first. No, I, I oh, could you have another fucking shot. do this. You have another shot. I could fucking oh, do wait. this. wait, charge, charge. It's okay, you it's okay. Charge. You gotta charge, man. He is charge, man. Oh, I'm You gotta charge, charge, man. Ah, uh, oh, fuck. I, I didn't uh, mean to do that. Jump! Not now. Jump. Ah, oh, fuck. No. Don't jump then. Don't jump. What jump. do you mean? You said don't jump. You always try to jump over him whenever he's doing that projectile, but you should wait until that projectile animation finishes and then jump now. Ah, there's jump. no fucking way. There's no fucking way. 
Come on. Well, that time you could have jumped. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, man. <laughs> in that case, you can't. But in most cases, don't jump. If, if I'm cornered, then I can jump. I had another shot. Yeah. All right, you got it this time. All right, wait, wait, wait. What the hell? Why does he just choose to do that sometimes? Because he's fucking pissed, dude. <laughs> he's fucking pissed. Stop doing that! Stop doing that! <laughs> you fucking asshole! Ugh. Will you chill out. Why does he? Why is he different sometimes? He doesn't really have a pattern when it comes to that charge. You just gotta be ready for it at any time. All right, I'm I'm fucked. I'm fucked. All right. <sighs> charge man's never give up. Well, yeah, I think I think being able to beat Charge Man with just the Buster, it's a good uh, stepping stone. Go. Uh, Stop walking in me! Stop walking in me! You just gotta you gotta. All right, so what you gotta do, man, is you get your one charge shot off, uh -huh. and then you focus on avoiding. Okay. And then whenever he stops and shoots again, and you jump over him, you get one more charge shot in. But don't try to get more than that. You got it if you just keep your head about your- Ooh. Hey! Hey! Why are you still doing whenever that? Whenever you hit him with the charge shot, whenever you, uh... Well, I guess just whenever he fucking feels like he's gonna charge you. Ah! Ah! No, 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 no! Ah! Damn it! No! Ah! Uh. Oh, man. <laughs> God damn it, no. You had it. All right, remember, the one charge shot strategy. It's fucked. I'm fucked. All right. Hey, do you remember one shot? I'm one remember. Shot. I'm remember. I'm remember. Ugh. He's just so fucking stupid. Yeah. I mean, you dominoes. almost had it. You had it. I did. You had it. I did. So, who's your favorite Mega Man character? Base, dude. Can't wait till we get to fucking Mega Man 7, bro. Yeah, Base is a cool character. I was in awe of him as a child. I he's was like, whoa! He's freaking dark Mega Man. <laughs> yeah, and he betrays you and everything. It's fucking cool. It's fucking cool. I love people who do that. Yeah. Traitors. <laughs> fucking traitors. <laughs> yeah, that was one of your first words. Traitors? He betrayed me. He betrayed me. <laughs> That's, some that's fucking some awesome. random friend of yours, some yeah random friend of yours, you're like, oh he hey, how's your friend Chase or whatever his name was. You know? <laughs> we were like, hey Dan, you know, how's your friend Chase? He's like, I'm, oh him, he betrayed me. <laughs> like, what the hell did that kid do? You guys he are fuck four. He fucked me up. How did you? Go how did he betray you? You're four. There's like nothing to do. There's no way to possibly betray a four year old. I don't think. That you fucking anyway. know of, dude. <laughs> I guess not. You just had a different childhood than I did, I guess. Just pretend that Charge Man betrayed you, dude. <laughs> and unleash your did. demon. He did. He's doing it right now. He's, He's doing it right you. now. He's betraying you. Dan, you're getting betrayed. Oh, fuck. Fuck you, Charge Man. Quit betraying me. Oh shit. Oh, I'm so fucking dumb. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You got it this time. You got it this time. Uh, dude, I'm so sweaty. I, I gotta put deodorant on. <laughs> I stink. <laughs> I stink. I smell like mega sweat. My mega balls. Ah, oh, mega Charge dumb. Man. All Charge right. man's charging your sweat up. Why do Doesn't I do that? Know. Why do I do that? Why is that? Why my... do you do that every time? Why do I do that? Why do I do that? Fuck off. <laughs> Wait. Yeah. Huh? No. No. You're, you're betraying me, Dan. Oh, you betrayed me. God damn it, dude. Are you serious? Ugh. All right. All right. So let me let me coach you through this one. Yeah. Charge. Charge up and go through that door, man. Go through that door. All right. Don't shoot. Don't shoot. I won't shoot. Jump. Shoot. Wait, 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 wait. Jump. Fuck, he got me. Ugh. Ugh. Wait for it, wait for it. Jump! Wait for it, wait for it. No! Jump is more important! 
Jump is my ability! <laughs> Jump! <laughs> Jump is more important! What does that mean? What does that mean? What does that it mean? Does not, don't worry about the charge shot, just jump! Fuck! <laughs> uh, God damn it. I will never forgive you. I'm fucking dying here. Jump! Jump! Charge! Stop! Okay, okay, okay. Stop! Okay. Jump is more important! Jump is more important! <laughs> jump! Then, then. Wait, 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 wait. Jump wait, is more important! Jump! Fuck! No! Jump! 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 Shoot! Stop, 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 stop! Charge! Jump! Charge! Stop, 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 stop! No, no, no! <laughs> Why did you go? Why did you go? Stop, 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 stop! Jump! Shoot! Ah! One more shot, one more shot, one more shot! Stop, 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 one step up the stairway. You got charge kick. Now you can kick. Fuck yeah. Alright. One down. Gravity man. Seven to go. No, 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 no. What? 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 Gravity man? What? Hey, I'm back. Gravity man is uh, another robot made by Dr. Wily. Um, he has the ability to control gravity, of course. He is a... a professor of gravity he loves the subject of gravity but apparently he has a terrible attitude unsocial loves to work alone also dislikes outer space uh because there's no gravity there um so he's definitely the most punchable robot master in this game i have a feeling i can kill gravity man i have it's not my recommended order but we're, we're paving a new try. path oh this guy's pretty tough i just go i just go you can fight him though, I guess, yeah. I just I had to prove to myself that I could. This is all about the experience of becoming the greatest gamer. Um, so, I have to do this shit. Uh, even if it's impossible. Alright, think about it. Think about it before you go. It's easy if you think about it. Well... <laughs> <laughs> I thought. The stage is cool though. I, I like the, the switching perspective shit. Um, I think Gravity Man fucking sucks though. Why? He sucks. He's just not that cool. Hey, what the hell, man? He's super cool, dude. No, dude. He's got a stupid face. Alright. Ah! Holy fuck! Alright. Alright, we're already at the boss. Hell yeah, dude. I told you. I told you I'm a, I'm I'm the man who fights this guy. They they didn't they didn't know I could fight this guy. Yeah. 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 I was born to fight you. Okay. okay. There we go, man. One Fuck shot. yeah. One shot, motherfucking gravity man, suck my gravity balls. <laughs> <laughs> this is about to be the best Let's Play of Mega Man of all time. You got gravity, bitch. I guess I shouldn't have recommended Charge Man stage first. Because <laughs> I can fucking wipe <laughs> that guy. <laughs> Alright, uh, Gyro all right. Man. <laughs> Dude, why are you choosing Gyro Man? Gyro Man is another robot... Uh, created by Dr. Wily for this game. Uh, he resembles a helicopter. Apparently he was supposed to have like a, a flying device. Um, I'm guessing like a jet engine or some shit like that. Something else that flies. But it was replaced by a propeller um, because of cost issues. Again, Dr. Wily is losing money. 
actively losing money. Um, and and we'll get to that in a, a second. Uh, his whole thing was he was meant to take over a garden and get money uh, for from like an admission fee to the garden. Uh, but apparently, Gyroman got so bored from doing this, he he just he just stopped. He just stopped caring about the about the about the money. He's very proud of his aerial lifestyle. And he hates other people. He feels like people are not worth his time. He likes to play with bamboo copters and eating gyros because they're gyros. Get it? Uh, he does not like jet engines. Uh, he hates those. Because look at this guy. He's got fucking blades on the back of his body. Fight him with only your buster. I don't, I don't know if I can, man. <laughs> <laughs> Fly. Ugh! Holy fuck. Okay. All right. Now he's spinning. Yeah, dude, I'm pretty good at spinning. What can I say? I spin all the time. Spin master. Like, dude, they do call me spin master. You're like a blade, babe blade. <laughs> I'm like a blade. You're a ba blade I'm a blade. babe blade oh, blade. Ah! No! No. The no. A. Oh shit, how do I get that? I guess I gotta fall a little bit. Gotta fall a little bit, but not a lot of it. How do I fall just enough? I don't think yeah. I can do it. Uh, just jump, you go get it, you, you, you need it. You I need it. I need it? You can't get it now. You can't get it now though. I need it? How many lives do I have left? Uh, you can, you can. I, I mean, have three. Ah, uh, don't worry about it. We can come back and get it later. If you need it. Okay. Down? Okay. Here I can we go. Never for sure know. Third if it's, boss. If it's a death trap or I should actually be going down there. Oh, you don't have full health, so you should try it with just your buster. Yeah? Okay. Yeah. We'll see how it goes. What's up, bastard? <laughs> Why do I do it backwards? Okay, he's he's tough. Okay, he's yeah, he's uh, he sucks. Um, I don't think I could do this. <laughs> what does this ability do? Ah. You gotta be careful though. Oh shit. <laughs> Oh man, he used all of it. Yeah, I accidentally used one extra that didn't kill him, so... Oh shit, I used all of it. Do it, dude. It's possible. What, what, what do I do? Dodge first. Okay. He's gonna shoot one of those things at you, and it stops in the air for a little while, and then it goes towards you, right? Yeah. And then you jump over it. But then, whenever he's up in the air, he's going to fall directly where you are. Directly down at you. Yeah, yeah. I figured. So, after you, after you dodge that one uh, projectile, you want to slide. Basically, because he's going to fall, you know, wherever you are at the time of ah, right, you right, land right, that right, jump. Right. If it's too much to, like, focus on doing your charge shot, just hit him with your regular shot. Just get used to his pattern, and then be able to dodge his pattern consistently and then start introducing the charge shot into your repertoire. Okay. You know what I mean? Okay. Like, that's what I always do. I get used... I get to the point where I can almost always dodge them, and then I start using the charge shot. Okay, but that sucks. I don't like that. Ah, let's get this fucking gyro over with. So it looks like they're making a Mega Man 12 through 15. Isn't that awesome? 12 through 15? Yeah, Eleven sold so well that uh, it actually sold better than any other game in the series so far. So, uh... That's crazy. This series, you know, they always, you know, a lot of fans want to see how it connects to X or whatever. But for me, I mean, they never have to portray that as far as I'm concerned. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, I want the series to just keep going forever. Leaving that up to your imagination, what happens to this character, that's much more interesting than anything that Capcom could come up with i think probably you know what i mean i i don't really want to yeah i think 
you know, saying that like, a couple oh, he years died. past is cool enough. Yeah, he's not here anymore. What happened to him is up to you to decide. Fall right here! Yeah. There you go, there you go, there you go. That's oh, man. what I'm fucking falling about. That's a pro game move right there. You're better than PewDiePie, officially. <laughs> Why? I don't know. I'm probably gonna die here, though. Get to the boss, dude. Don't die here. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> I told you not to do it. I fucked up! I'm sorry! If I were you, the way to always play it safe is take two lives where you're not even attacking him and just focus only on dodging him. You okay. know what I mean? Sure. It's like it's like when you're learning how to play an instrument or play the guitar, you know, you you're playing slowly, you know, and as you get better and better at playing that song, you add some more I don't know, frills and vibrato or whatever. But <laughs> for right now, dude, you just wanna play the basic song and that's being able to dodge his crap. Alright. Time to play the basic song. Just focus on dodging. Don't even shoot him. Don't charge anything. Just dodge him. Okay. <laughs> I think I got it. <laughs> Play the basic song. Play the basic, basic song. song. Part two. Basic song. Come on. Dodge him. Dodge him so many times that he just gets pissed, dude. It's like, fuck, I can what never the fuck? hit this bitch. Basic song. Basic song. Basic song it. Okay. Basic song. Jump. Jump. Basic song. My right, basic song, man. This is how we do it. Basic song. All right. Baby steps. Baby steps. But that fucking shit. Hey, what the hell? He delayed! Basically, he has two choices, to jump up and do that, or to throw one of those at you. Okay. Right? So, I mean, he could choose either one, programming-wise. But hey, I think you got a hold of it, right? I mean, it's not so bad if you just uh, focus on dodging, right? Yeah, yeah. So now, take out your gravity hole. My gravity hole. Take out your hole. Okay. And. Just whenever you feel like the time is right, use it. And don't use it consecutively. Okay. Because you'll run out of power. If you miss one time, you won't be able to kill him. Okay. So, I mean, focus on dodging. And whenever you feel like, okay, I got an opening, then shoot. Okay. I got you. Nice. All right. See, gotta play the basic song first, man. Yeah, dude. That was my that was my vibrato. I just added some vibrato right there. <laughs> there you go, dude. There's your vibrato. <laughs> you did some hemorrhage, some pull offs. What's this? Green. You got gyro attack and rust jet and rust jet. Damn. You want me to do wave man? Yeah. Why not? Wave man's kind of like a different different deal, man. His stage. Really? You're gonna love it. Okay. Love. It's, it's the first time, it's the first time for this kind of stage to appear. Wave Man, uh, yet another emotional and easily moved to tears uh, robot. Unlike Starman, uh, he apparently is very angry uh, and he and he's just violent. He's just a motherfucker. Uh, definitely antisocial, not easily approachable, and just hates conversation. I kind of feel, I kind of feel for him in, in, in that way. He hates pollution. That's totally fair. I think I get this guy. 
personally. I think this guy, I agree with him. I fucking, I fucking hate pollution too. I, I don't blame him. It's a classic, man. Oh, it just shows up whenever I go there. That sucks. Yeah, exactly. Huh? Huh? Whoa, oh. whoa, whoa. What the fuck? Well, hey, you got the extra life. That's true. Cool. What is this? This you'll see again in uh, Mega Man 9. So, get on that and remember where that... You just want to keep going up on that bubble. Oh, really? I don't want to Keep wanna, going like, on the bubble. Here. Stay on that bubble, bud. Bubble, bud. Stay on that bubble, bud. Wait. Jump. 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 Nice. Ready? Jump. Jump. Ah! Same reaction. Jump. Jump. Ah, thank God. Okay. All right. So what I was talking about is coming up. Yeah? Okay. Oh. Oh, damn. Hey, this is the first time Mega Man ever do this. <laughs> first time Mega Man do that? I've never seen Mega Man do this before. Mega Man, you do this? Mega Man, what you doing? Mega Man, what you doing on there? Hey, what the fuck, fish? <laughs> <laughs> first time a fish jump. First Damn. time a fish jump. First time Man. I ever seen fish jump in Mega Man. That's, that's new. That's new. Is this washing machines? That's badass. By the way, uh, there's gonna be a uh, letter coming up. So you gotta, you gotta be prepared for it. Well, fucking battle toads and shit. Okay, I gotta avoid fish, the fish. Fish, 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 fish. Yes. I'm like an angry video game nerd there. <laughs> hey, what the frick, man? Shoot the green. Am I winning? You're winning. Hell yeah, dude. Nice winning. Where am I? Keep going. Oh, do I have to? Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I was like, damn, Mega Man, you're taking a long time. <laughs> yeah, for some reason, that part right there, you can control the scroll. Control the scroll. Ugh! Fish! Stop fishing me, man! Damn. Stop being fished. I can't help it. Fuck these men. That's not a man, that's a fish. Fuck <laughs> men fish. Ah, no! Ah! I got hit! I gotta die. I gotta you die. Can't die. I gotta don't die. die here. Don't die down here. Don't, 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 don't. Why don't not? Here. Trust Why me. not? Trust me. Don't but I need here. that E, dude. Come back and get it later. Ah, oh, fuck, dude. I don't need that. What do we got going on? Well, hang on. Here? Pause. Four lives. All right, basic song, dude. Basic, basic song. Basic song. And what? what's my ability? Charge it's, kick. It's charge kick, right? Yeah, okay. And by the way, I, by the way, the charge kick is kind of hard to land because it's a, you have to slide to use it. What the fuck? Okay. Yeah, you have to slide to so use it. So I have it. to slide and then slide? Slide? Him. Yeah. So it's literally a kick, okay. It's literally a kick. <laughs> Basic song. What the fuck did he just do to me? <laughs> <laughs> what did he do? He water sprouted. Alright, basic sprouted song. You, basic song. Jump or slide. Okay, so he's a dick. Okay. You gotta do the small jump. Do the baby jump. Gotta do the baby jump. Oh, Here we go. Another basic song. See? It's, a, it's just a pattern, man. I see. Alright. I mean, go ahead and try with the charge kick, because from what I remember, it's pretty hard to use. Okay. But you might end up messing up this anyway, so... Confidence. Bum rush him. Yeah, no, that, that is a terrible attack. Alright, I think I'm gonna go Buster. No! Oh my god! Oh my god, dude! Whenever you get hit, you can't jump anymore! What the fuck? Who's in control? Who's in control of the jumping? <laughs> <laughs> it's not me! Okay. But shoot him only when you feel comfortable. Alright. Basic song. Focus only. on dodging. Dodging. Ah! Water man. Fucking, what's his name? He's Wave Man. Wave, Wave Man. Man. Just fucking rush him, you think? Rush him. 
Fucking Russian, you think? Ah. That worked. That worked. <laughs> Why did that work? That's how you do it, dude, with the charge kick. Now, the tough thing will be the final stage when you have to fight him again. Yeah, you have to be all eight Robot Masters again, and you see how kind of uh, haphazard that move is. So I recommend when we get to the last guy, you want to uh, try to fight Wave Man first. Generally, I recommend fighting Starman with just your buster, just to kind of up your skill. I, I, guess, I guess we'll go Starman. He's got a poncho. Starman was meant to chill on Dr. Wily's space station. He's apparently uh, a romanticist. Uh, he loves opera and he loves musicals. Apparently he is very emotional though. He often makes decisions uh, to quote the wiki uh, based on feeling rather than reason um, and does not get on well with pessimists. His one dream in life is to travel through space with a love of his own. I can only assume because of his lack of gravity and Gravity Man's uh, superfluous gravity, the immense gravity that is on that man, Gravity Man probably fucking hates Starman, like just fucking dislikes the shit out of him. I mean, Starman, Starman loves space, Gravity Man hates space, so they, they, they probably don't get along. Yeah, man, this is like the stage that is representative of Mega Man 5 for me. So are you more of an X guy or original series? Well, I guess you really can't say until you've beaten them all. I'm more of a Zero yeah, guy, no. I guess, so far. <laughs> but that's only because I've played two out of that series. I do like the aesthetic of X the most, I think. Though, I do like, I like, I like Zero. I like all of it. I think they all look really cool. Mega Man Zero, the series, right? Yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, yeah, I would say, you know, even though I have a longer history with X, I like the original games better than uh, X, I believe. I think, uh, yeah, probably these games are more consistent, right? Well, oh. there we go. Yeah, they are more consistent, I, I guess, you know, because you have 7 and 8, which aren't that great. Uh, like not even six is considered very good. I like six though, but uh, story-wise, I think, because uh, I think isn't X Five supposed to be considered like the end of the series? Well, that's yeah, what Inafune intended. Right. But uh, we don't really listen to that guy anymore. <laughs> yeah, we don't listen to that guy. Yeah, I prefer the original, the aesthetic of the original. I like uh, how simple it is. Uh, I like that the. Robot masters are humanoid, you know? Right, right. Instead of ro animals. I do like the animal designs, but generally speaking, I just overall like ah, the design what? of these oh. games more. Wow, that's a nice one. That was a nice play. My favorite character would be uh, Blues, you know? Yeah, Proto, Proto, Proto Man, Man for y'all Westerners. <laughs> you know the story of Proto Man or, or not? Uh, he was made by Dr. Light and Dr. Wily, and he he wears a scarf because he's kind of fucked up or something like that. But uh, uh, what like Dr. Wily promised that he would he would make him whole or some shit. Uh, but Proto Man's like, nah, I'm fucking epic. Dr. Light and Dr. Wily have both offered to uh, extend his lifespan, mm. but he's worried that. Uh, he wouldn't become him. With his programming, right? right and right. then he'd lose his free will. And I wonder so, if that yeah. has anything to do with the the virus that Wily creates in the X series. Maybe he does fuck with him. Or I I know that uh Zero is based off of the Oh, I just walked in, by the way. <laughs> Your jump is basically infinite in this stage. But yeah, I think um yeah, uh Proto Man's design is based off of or Zero's design is based off of uh, prototypes of uh, of Proto Man, I guess. But I guess that's why he's called Proto Man. I thought there's a connection between uh, Zero and Base. I think that I think so that, too. That Wily was, I that's Power Fighters uh, story though, so I don't know how canon that is, but yeah, he's working on Zero 
during the power fighters. Yeah, you see Wily showing the kind of skeleton of Zero at the end of that game to base, saying, I, I, hey, I'm making something even stronger than you. <laughs> That's such an asshole move. <laughs> I'm making something better than you. All right, let's do this shit. I think I could get this guy. This guy doesn't seem terribly hard. I think I'm just uh, a dumbass. Yeah, let's focus, focus. At this point, most of the robot masters were designed by like kids, right? Right, right, right. Uh, they held like competitions in Japan and shit. Uh, which uh, there were there were a couple that were design designed by, I guess North Americans like Canadians, right? I don't know if Americans made any. Yeah, I think there are a few. I know Nightman from Mega Man Six is uh, one of those. That is a cool. That's design. the only one I remember for some reason, though. Yeah, I guess because I like that design. I was like, oh wow. And Let's Starman's fucking dead. American. There we go, man. Got your second Buster only kill. How did they? Do you know how they they did those competitions? I think like in Nintendo Power or something like that. They yeah said, hey, send uh, your designs for Mega Man. And, what, uh, what, what was the magazine equivalent in Japan? Maybe Famitsu? Hmm. I don't know. That's a good question. Yeah, we should probably look that up next time. Alright, so, so... Crystal Man? Yeah. This stage is hard, by the way. Yeah? Yeah. How many lives left do I have? I, I think I have two? If three? this is the stage I'm thinking of... Crystal Man was created to solve Dr. Wily's financial problems by creating artificial crystals and selling them. Yet again, Dr. Wily, incredibly, incredibly poor, need, needs money so bad that he creates robots to make him money. That seems a little bit counteractive, but I mean, whatever. I mean, if you can make a robot to do anything, just make a robot that makes money. You, you're a, a scientist. You're an evil scientist. Just fucking manipulate people uh crystal man loves the art of illusion he loves fortune telling and he hates he hates scientists hates those guys this is a hard stage yeah this is it this is a hard stage looks a bit aesthetically like uh what's his what's his fucking gemini man yeah gemini man what's that Mega Man 3 yeah. Mega Man 4 Mega Man 3 Gotcha. There's only one reason why it's hard, but I, I won't I won't spoil it for you. Yeah, we haven't gotten to it yet. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that's annoying. One, two, what? One. What? When? <laughs> huh? One, two. One, two, three. Uh, what you fucking what 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 there's never been a four there has never been a four there's never been a four now now do you understand is that the hard part is that that's is that the it? hard part that's... there's no fucking rhyme or reason to those crystals <laughs> what the fuck all right all right i don't know i don't know what the pattern is i i totally forget i think it's totally random that's bullshit and it's usually it's usually when you jump is whenever like the pattern totally fucking changes. All right. Holy shit, just stop dropping. Ugh. Like yeah, right then, you should. Yeah. Sure. Right then. Oh right my then. god. Ugh. God damn. Go. Hold on, oh, I just no. I just want to feel it out. I just want to feel it out. That was really fucking. I I really tested it. What the fuck is up with this Capcom? All right. There we go. Awesome, dude. Oh, it's my friend. There's Eddie. Holy shit! Who did By the this way, if you shit? die here, if you die here, you have to go back to the very beginning of the stage. <laughs> wow, dude, you're so lucky with all these extra lives. Oh, Alright. Alright, man, you got it. Eat tank, eat tank. Hey, first one. Fuck yeah. Oh, shit! Okay. That's an M tank? <laughs> Dang, dude. 
mega. It's a mega fucking tank. Shit. Is this it? This is it? This must be it. Ah! Oh. Uh, what the fuck? Oh, this is this is something you often see in the Mega Man games. That exact same pattern. Left, 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 left. What was that V? That was one of the letters, dude. Oh shit, that was the five? Yeah. Meg Amma. Or M -M 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 Mama. <laughs> <laughs> you got the mama. Hey, dude, pause it. Too many lives you have. You must have at least four. Ah, uh, three. <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, basic song, man. You don't want to do this stage again. I don't want to do this stage again, you're right. I should have so, got the V. Let's, let's be careful. Alright, what you got, man? Okay, that's stupid. So basically, he uses the Windows 95 screensaver attack. <laughs> okay. Ah, <laughs> oh, but it sucks. Gyro attack is kind of strange because you shoot it, right? And it just goes forward. But if you press up, you can make the gyro attack go up or down based off of uh, your input. Oh, so it's kind of like... Did uh, you understand that? It's kind of like a... Uh, um, is, it, is it similar to the gear? Or whatever it is from uh, Mega Man 2? Not really. You or, shoot it in gear, front of you. Metal. You shoot it in front of you, and then at any time you can press up and make it go upward. Oh. You see how he jumps so much? Yeah. Like, if you just if you just shoot the gyro attack, it's probably not going to hit him. You have to shoot it and then time it to where as it'll go up and slam right into his ass. Okay. So I needed to slam his ass. I need to slam his yeah. ass. Slam his ass. Slam his ass. Dude, you're doing it. Dan, you're a really awesome ass slammer. <laughs> Thanks, man. <laughs> <sighs> Alright. You S did it, dude. Slam that guy. Wow. We're making progress. Yeah, dude. So I guess we're just gonna give up on getting these letters. What does what does it do? Just tell me what it does. You wanna know? Does it uh well, give me a bird? <laughs> It gives you beat, yeah, it gives you beat. And if you fall on a pit, beat will come and rescue you. Does he rescue and you also, every time? Not every time, I think a few times. Maybe, no, I'm thinking about a different game. Beat in this game is fucking awesome. Beat, basically, <laughs> you can you can call him, and he just like beats the fucking shit out of everything <laughs> on the screen. That's what beat does. Damn. I mean, he's crazy, dude. He just goes nuts. <laughs> he's fucking crazy. I mean, it's pretty useful, but. You can get by without it. In fact, I recommend you not use it for your first playthrough. You know? Okay, sure. So we just beat Crystal Man at Crystal Man, or Na Napalm Man is weak to Crystal Man, right? Yeah. And uh, Napalm Man beats uh, Snow Stone, Stone, Man. Stone Man. Yeah. Okay. Stone so Man. we got we got to yeah. do Napalm Man next. I think uh, we'll complete these uh and then we'll probably do a break and come back tomorrow i'm just gonna die to these tigers i think actually these tigers fuck these tigers dude no more tigers tired of these tigers Nape oh man like of all the possible things they could make a boss character out of <laughs> napalm napalms you know? feel Why bad is... for all the vietnamese players <laughs> yeah it's vietnam obviously <laughs> this is fucked up terrible Terrible, Capcom. What were you thinking? What Probably are you some thinking? North American guy <laughs> came up with Napalm Man. <laughs> hey, what the fuck? Oh. Oh. Alright, fuck these tigers. Fuck! <laughs> fuck this tiger! Fuck you! Ah! Jump, shot. Jump and shoot. Ah, fuck these tigers! <laughs> Can't wait to napalm these tigers. Bend in the United States military. Gotta napalm these fucking tigers. <laughs> Fuck these tigers. God damn. Okay. Are there tigers? Are there wild tigers in Vietnam? Probably. I don't. <laughs> I don't. I don't know. All right. Somebody from Vietnam, please respond below. Are you offended by napalm men? And are there tigers in your country? <laughs>
Sorry to be so Basic insensitive song, to Dan. Vietnam. Basic song. Vietnam. Basic song. <laughs> I'm sorry I'm insensitive to Vietnam. But uh, <laughs> But I don't know if there's tigers in your yourself. country. Just call in and kill yourself. Ah damn it. Oh shit, there was a I just picked up a life! <laughs> That was a, a miracle of death right there. I wonder if this is a strategy that everyone uses, you know? Replenishing your lives this way. This has to be. Like, it, it fucking works, right? It does work. Oh, I'm a dumbass. <laughs> <laughs> well, go ahead and kill yourself two more times. Alright. They do They do growl. They go fucking, ah! Such tigers of Vietnam. <laughs> the tigers of Vietnam. That's a band that we should create. Napalm the tigers of Vietnam. <laughs> I like the designs of... Most of the animals that they do in these games, because they always give them the, like the, joints that are like, you see those, those Way like weird, yeah, yeah, gigantic holes for some reason. It's fucking awesome. Does Wiley I mean, himself make uh, these, yeah, like robots? Of course. I know he doesn't necessarily. There, there are like many videos about like, uh, the fact that Wiley hasn't made most of the goddamn robots that you fight in the series. Really? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, even though they're like uh, considered like, or they're under Wily, uh, Wily's uh, numbers, like uh, specific uh, inventors have oh, their yeah, own yeah, yeah. Wily numbers uh, and shit I kinda like that. I kind of know what you mean. The the first in the first game, all of them were made by Doctor Light. Right. And the fourth game, they were all made by Doctor Kosak. Right. But what about the second and third game? So I think he makes the robots in two. I suck ass. Yeah, he um, definitely makes the robots in two, right? Some robots are made by him, and other robots are like just like general all-purpose use robots. I mean, think about it though. Doctor Wily makes a new fucking castle every game. So, <laughs> I mean, that's that's already hard enough work. True. I I think uh, there's one of them that's like. Uh, their lore is that they're like a repurposed refrigerator that he stole from Dr. Light. <laughs> so he's just, imagine how fucking petty that shit is. Like, he just fucking s sneaks into Wily or fucking Dr. Light's house just to steal his fridge and turn it into an evil robot. <laughs> that's so. Uh, that's yeah, the most fridge. badass shit. <laughs> Mega Man, you're killing my fridge! Mega Man, bring my fridge back! <laughs> you know, he like clearly loses some, some budget and shit. Uh, I think Junk Man is it Mega Man Seven Junk Man or Mega Man Eight? Uh, Mega I don't Man remember. Four. Mega Man Four Junk Man. Oh yeah, Seven 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 Junk Man. Dust yeah. Man is four. Dust Man. Uh, yeah, I think uh, Junk Man is uh, outright said to be a creation of Doctor Light. However, he is uh, just garbage. Like he's just put together with garbage. <laughs> <laughs> That's why he's. Pissed, dude. Look at Mega Man. He's awesome. He's a hero. I'm just junk. <laughs> yeah, it's shit like that. I, uh, yeah, Mega I Man looks pretty Mega cool. Man too. I, I would fucking kill Mega Man. He looks awesome. Um, how? Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Here we go. The end of the stage. How many lives? Press start. Two. Two. All right. Basic song. This is a freaking hard basic song from what I remember. Okay. What's his weakness hard. again? It's the crystals. Crystal man. Whoa, napalm man. Napalm, dude. Damn, he's fucked up. He's fucked in the head, dude. This is the only guy I think I struggled a bit with, with the Buster run. God damn. God damn. Oh my god. Yeah, that explo- the napalm, dude. How do I get out of that shit whenever he fucking pulls me in a corner like that? Damn. See that tank in the background? That's badass. Yeah. The what Panzer. It? Crystal Eye? It's badass. How does it shoot? I, I forget. Oh my god, please! Dude, no! Oh. What? He <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Game. Hey guys, welcome back to Mega Man 5. Uh, this is uh still in the same video, but this is the second session we've had with Mega Man 5. Um, so far, 
Hopefully this is the last one. But yeah, we're fucking coming back to Napalm Man. This fucking asshole. Napalm Man is a robot master created by Dr. Wily to help defend and protect his secret weapons factory. So this is his secret weapons factory we're in right now. Where he would spend his spare time collecting and searching for weapons as strong or stronger than his own. Okay. So, so he's a weapons enthusiast, equipped with an array of explosive weapons all over his body. It says for his personality, he's uh, considered to be a walking weapon, so his allies feel uncomfortable near him, <laughs> resulting in his lack of friends. So really Wily's that. secret weapons factory is basically like three <laughs> tanks. <laughs> <laughs> he has fucking World War II tanks. That's pretty cool, I guess. Doesn't even use them. All right. Like, Mayor in the in the base, for Christ's sake. <laughs> Use your tanks! That's right, bitches. Mega Man's in the building. I'm telling you, Dan, you're not gonna win! Why not? You're just wasting your what? You're just wasting your ammo. I guess. I just have to avoid his ass. Alright. Kill, kill your ass! Thank God. Oh, there we go. Nice. Holy Last shit. Last one. We're, we're down to Stone Man. Well, there goes your secret weapons factory, Wily. Oh, he's got some more tanks in here, I guess. Yeah, not using them. I guess Wily was caught unawares. When <laughs> Mega Man invaded the base. Invaded the base. When Mega Man invaded the base. When Mega Man invaded the base. All right, yeah. let's get. We got fucking Stone Man left. Finally. I think you have to game over first, though. Probably. Guess who's his friend? Oh, I do know, I do know this. Um, so, Stone Man, uh, he was built by Wily to look, look as strong as bricks do. Is that the real origin story? Yes. He wanted a robot that looked like it was as strong as bricks. Which, which why would you need means... to do that? Because they're already robots, which means they're made of metal. <laughs> <laughs> and, I mean... Bricks are not that strong, right? No. I mean, earthquakes, <laughs> no. earthquakes would, you know, cause brick buildings to collapse. Fun fact, kids. Jump down the hole. Jump down the hole. Jump down the hole? Trust me. Trust me. Oh my Jump god. Down the hole. Okay. You just want me Continue. to kill myself? Yeah, exactly. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> Okay, I thought, I thought it was just, be, it was just being like, being an asshole. <laughs> the Rockman and Base database, uh, which exists. Um, oh yeah, I know. I think you, it's, you collect I think it's CDs cool. in the game and uh, you can kind of fill up this database of robot masters. And uh -huh. The line that he says in that is like, Guts man, let's go see a movie or yeah. something like that. <laughs> he says, let's go see a movie. What the hell? <laughs> he just wants to go hang out with his friend. Guts man is dead. <laughs> oh, what? Oh, yeah, Gusman's been like <laughs> reassembled. He's been dead and for like five games now. <laughs> one of the games, I don't remember which one. I think it's like the third game or something. No, no, no. I don't remember what game it is, but Gusman's body is reused again to yeah, make yeah, a. Yeah. I think that's seven, actually. I think it's, yeah, I think it's seven. These bats don't make any sense. They should not be flying. Yeah, they like look that. like Arabian bats. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I thought they were as a kid. <laughs> wow, these bats have turbans. Wily is just like really shitty at coming up with designs sometimes. I mean, that <laughs> last thing is just a light. It's just a, a traffic code. A light on a spring. <laughs> He's supposed to be an evil scientist, like a mad scientist, you know? And that's the best he can do is come up with these like turban faces and the same damn enemy he's had for like the last five games. I like how uh, Mega Man 11 implies that uh, Wily pretty much peaked whenever he was a kid, like in university. He invented the fucking gear system and then just never used it, but it was clearly better than <laughs> anything else at the time. How did he forget about it? I mean, he could equip that to like all of his. Uh, he could have just like had that. Shit. Yeah, why didn't he put that shit on base? And then Mega Man would have been screwed, dude. Because yeah, they can slow down time. He should have just, like, not told Light that that's what he was doing. But then again, there are some robot masters like Flashman that, like, stop time and stuff, so maybe they're using the gear system to do that. I don't know. I wow. think that's just kind of their ability. Wow, to... Mega Man community! <laughs>
That's a theory for you. There, there you go, guys. <laughs> You're welcome. There you go. We're doing your work for you, you fucking idiots. <laughs> Don't call the Mega Man community fucking idiots. When I was a kid, though, I guess it holds true today to some degree. Uh, you know, people would ask me, what game do you like? And I would say, oh, I like Mega Man, you know? Uh -huh. And they'd be like, oh, wow, you like that hard game? And people would want to come over to my house and watch me play Mega Man. Really? Yeah. Damn. And, I mean, no one even attempted to play it. There was, they were like, this had the image of it being such a hard, impossible game. So, a lot of friends come, came over and would watch me play. But, uh, yeah, in my opinion, I mean, there's a, a lot of games that are much harder than Mega Man. Castlevania, or... What else is harder? Holy Diver. Fucking Mario Bros. 3. <laughs> Mario Bros. 3 kicks my ass, dude. I've I've beaten like every hard uh, NES game, but uh, the the Famicom version of Mario Bros. 3, not not the NES version, super hard. It is hard. I think you have to use Napalm Man oh, really? weapon here. Maybe. What does Napalm Man's fucking shit do? Oh, explode shit, right? Uh, it's a Bomb. It's an N bomb. Holy shit! It's an N bomb. <laughs> yeah. shit, Whoa! Don't drop the N bomb on this stream. Please don't. Why is it? Why is it called why that? Why is it the N bomb? That is crazy. Whoa! I mean, they re-released it and everything, and it's still, and it's the, still N -bomb. the N bomb. <laughs> oh fuck! Damn. Damn. Wait, how the fuck do I uh, use this? Never mind. <laughs> don't use the M bomb. <laughs> Just forget it. <laughs> don't don't use the M bomb anymore. <laughs> Damn, the end bomb. I'm fucking flustered. Why is it called that? Um, I, I don't need that fucking life. So it's not that I guess Napalm Man is also a racist. <laughs> Makes sense. Not, He's a Vietnam vet. Only is it from Vietnam? Jet your ass over there. I can probably still jet my ass over there. You can. Rush, you piece of shit! Some, in some of the games, you can control Rush. But uh, in other games, you just kind of just go straight. Mega Man 6, you can control him, right? You also get, like, a power-up to... Wait, what? Whoa. Oh, there. Oh. Okay. That's, That's kind of badass. That's kind of a wasted... Potential. Yeah, who fucking would think to do that? And then you would just get fucking bullshit. Yeah, a little bit of energy, nothing else. Oh, you didn't, you didn't find the letter, yeah, dude. No, I, I guess it's because you dropped the M bomb. <laughs> Maybe that's why. It's, it's a, a dark song. path. You should never go down. All right. I like how he just breaks. He really wanted one to be as strong as bricks. I jumped too high. It breaks me. <laughs> oh, I couldn't move. Damn it. He, he creates an earthquake, which makes him collapse. That's Japanese people's image of uh, brick structures. <laughs> earthquake, they collapse. That's why you can't find any brick buildings for the most part in Japan. That is true. But he's called Stone I mean, I Man. I only know of one. Yeah, he's not Brick Man. Why is he bricks? This guy's kind of easy, um, is what I'm realizing. Exactly. Like, I could probably do this guy Buster only. I got four lives. I might as well waste one trying to kill him. Well, I recommend using the charge shot this time, yeah. which you didn't do. Yeah. But then again, you're supposed to be just learning the pattern. Yeah, I wasn't really trying to actually kill him. I was just seeing whenever I could get a hit off. Ow. You're doing a good job getting a hit off. Thanks, man. All right, this is going to be it. I'm going to kill his ass. Get up, bitch. OK. <laughs> you're in. Oh, shit. Oh, you're going to die. It's over. What do you mean, man?
Man, this is a fight. Wow, that over. was that was a good one. Thank you for that, Dan. That was fucking awesome. That was the coolest. You didn't drop any am bombs. No. You didn't drop any am bombs. Yeah, I was, I'm trying to censor myself these days. You don't want to repeat history. You got Power Stone. Fuck yeah. Sweet. Capcom Let's would play make it. that game later. <laughs> Let's play it then. Why did you continue? What the hell? Continuing does that? Well, nice we're job. playing the game all over again. Welcome back, guys. We're here at <laughs> Gutsman's Best Friend's Hideout. <laughs> Gutsman's Best Friend. Let me just I mean, of all time. things for those guys to do, go <laughs> see a movie? I mean, they break the seats. <laughs> they break they the, break seats, the fucking seats. Why don't they go, like, fucking lift weights and shit or do some construction or whatever the fuck they're built for? Yeah. <laughs> Damn. Fuck. <laughs> Why are they gonna go see a movie? Why? What movie are they gonna go see? It's gonna be something with construction. <laughs> like office space. <laughs> you know what's interesting is, uh... Uh... I, I'll, 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 I'll... Oh, fucking Proto Man! <laughs> Kill your brother. Kill me, Dan. Make it? Oh, whoa, holy shit, Proto Man. How'd you Proto get Man. this hideout? Man, Proto Man... He's like Decked out. Wily level. He's like a crazy. Wily threat. Look at him. All right. Oh, this song. You're really not utilizing your uh, powers to the max. You gotta use your powers to the max. What does Dan. that mean? What do you mean by that? You have all the robot powers, like M bomb. I'm not gonna use that. I'm not using it. Well, you don't use the M bomb, but you can use like the Star Crusher. You can use your Gyro Dying Attack, Gyro Attack, and then whenever the the tigers go up, you can send that thing up too. Bada bing, bada boom. Oh, that didn't it work didn't very work well. at all. <laughs> You're right, these abilities suck. <laughs> Somebody in the comments is gonna be like, They don't suck! They're the best ones! <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Alright, Rush Coil. Rush! Rush! Off the top of your head, who's your favorite robot master? In this game? I guess in this game. Let's limit it to this game. Okay. Nah, I think that's the most fair. Probably Gravity Man. Why? He was the easiest. <laughs> I guess I had the opposite opposite idea. I like Nip Nipon man, he's the hardest to to fight like Buster only. What are you doing? Why wouldn't that work? Proto Man ever come back here? This is his house, right? <laughs> this is his crib. How did he afford this? <laughs> Dude, he has free will. <laughs> Probably is a business owner. Damn. There's a lot of financial support programs for robots. They're a minority. Robot minorities. I, I like the aesthetic of these castles because they're just like a medieval castle blended with just some some pipes and shit. I like how there's like several castles in the background. I mean, how like yeah, there's much no money do you way. have to waste? There's no way they built those <laughs> that many castles for Proto Man. Yeah, dude, they did. Stone Man built them all himself. He's like, and then Proto Man's like, yeah, I'll let you meet Guts Man if you build me one more castle. <laughs> I believe oh, that. sweet! I think that would actually happen. That's why they're all made of brick. Look at look at look at the design. Look at them. Look, look at them. God damn, Proto Man, chill out! Oh shit! No! Ah! Oh. Get the rhythm down in your head. Some of the bo blocks are totally useless, so... Fuck! I was almost there. Hey, since we have some downtime and we're still making progress on the game, uh, I think it's time for our first ever Mega Man trivia time, bitch! Shout out to the people over at the Mega Man Wiki, uh, y'all are some historians for real. So keep your fucking pants on, everyone, it's about to get goddamn serious with all these Mega Man facts, you're not even gonna believe this shit. Uh, first one, uh, Mega Man 5 is the first game in the series to begin using the date 2000XX. 
Um, previous games only took place in 2000X. Next one. Uh, this might be more of a Mega Man 6 fact, actually, now that I'm looking at it. But either way, uh, this is the last Mega Man game on the NES to be published in Europe. Uh, 6 never released there initially. Um, this was also the last to be published by Capcom in North America. Uh, Nintendo themselves published Mega Man 6. This next one is just insane that anyone would draw this connection uh, at all. Um, like, honestly, leave it to Mega Man fans to even notice this kind of shit. And um, in, in, So, in 5, uh, when you're doing the boss rush stage at the end of the game, like you do in most other Mega Man games, uh, Mega Man steps on a teleporter and is taken to a room identical to the room you initially fought the Robot Masters in. This is one in a grand total of two games in this series that do this. Uh, the other one being Mega Man Extreme 2. Every other Mega Man game apparently has unique rooms for their Robot Masters, but not 5. <laughs> or Extreme 2. And, last but not least, uh, but kinda least, just kind of a little throwaway fact, Mega Man 5's enemies have longer invincibility frames than every other title, um, for whatever reason. Your goal is to beat all the Mega Man games, right? Yeah. So, my recommendation with almost everything is don't use the cheap way. Go, do it do it the way that you think the designers intend you to... You know, intend, intend for you to do it the way they intend... And they, the, da, 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 da. Uh huh, uh huh. <laughs> the way they intend for you to play. That way, you know, a, a lot of these games, it's the same kind of gimmicks over and over and over again, just different patterns, right? So, you gotta get used to everything. All right. You got the, you got that one. That one's that, a okay. pretty common pattern in most of the games. So here, jump, disappear, and then there. Three blocks. One, two, three. And jump there. Okay. One here. One, two, three. <sighs> there we go. Nice. Yeah. I don't, know if that's actually, I don't know if that's actually his weakness. Holy shit, he's so fast. He's getting faster. Ah, uh, Dan, 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 yes! Oh, oh baby! Oh, oh. Yeah! Did it. You did it. God damn it, Proto Man. Okay, that's fucking stupid. Why is this like this? <laughs> Oh! Favorite Mega Man box art. You know what? Or Rockman. I mean, favorite Mega Man box art? Uh. Probably Mega Man 6. I think it's cool Rock that Man Mega 6? Man 6? Yeah. I think it's cool that he's got the jet, the, the red. Uh, ah, you jet. mean Mega Man 6 then? My uh, three favorite box arts are 6, uh, 1, and 2. And that's for, that's for the Famicom releases. Hmm. I love the old, you know, dinky-looking Famicom oh, yeah. Mega Man. Original Rockman is you know, really cool. The baby. He looks like a baby. Uh... Holy shit, I'm here. Two lives? Oh my fucking god, I'm crazy. Does this guy also have a weakness? Everyone has a weakness, man. Everybody's got a wish. Everybody. I'm jumping now, bitch. He doesn't believe you. Shoot! I did! Oh, <laughs> thank god. <laughs> Alright, so that's level two, right? Yeah, that's level two. Proto Man had all the money to build these, like, fortresses, but he didn't have enough money to make another song. <laughs> Mega Man must be really confused right now. Mixed feelings. I mean, his brother saved him so many times. Well, <laughs> about <Once>. twice. <laughs> Once or twice. <laughs> uh, he trained him too. Technically, in Mega Man 3, uh, his attacking you is like him training you. Is that training? I guess yeah. that's training. Fuck! Exact. Just like I'm training you now. Maybe. Oh so. my god. That's. That's, uh. What older brothers do. They train Mega Man. Jump! There we go. Um.
And as soon as you do that... Oh! Why did you do that? I didn't realize what it would do. I mean, I mean, I did, but I was like, oh, I gotta switch back. But I forgot that if I did that, that would not be good. Oh, what the fuck? What do I do about this? Oh. He just ups and freezes you, dude. You can do it, you can do it. Oh, you're fucked. You better eat I'm thing. gonna have to eat thing. It doesn't feel good, but... Well, let's necessary. see, if you don't get hit one more time, then you could have done it without the eating. No, ah, no. you died! <laughs> yeah, I needed the eating. You... You really died. I really super died. God damn! Just let me hit you once, dude! Oh my god, you gotta eating again! Uh. Kill him! Oh my <laughs> god, you're gonna give me a heart attack. Uh, oh uh, man, Danny. What the fuck? These games better get fucking easier as I play. <laughs> now we do the boss rush, huh? A boss rush, boss Russian, huh? Doesn't make any sense, but you hit that what? one down there. <laughs> what? Oh. Okay. Don't make the same mistake. <laughs> well, I made a different one, I guess. <laughs> well, yeah. Is this gonna kill me? Probably. Where did I go wrong? Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> it doesn't kill you. Okay, okay, sweet. Sweet. Oh, it's distorted. Proto man, my brother. Hello. Huh? 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 Hey, what the fuck? Damn. The real Proto oh. man. Here he comes. Whoa. Who would have thunk it? It was actually him this whole time. L. What does L stand for? Life. Probably. Ha! Huh! So your brother wasn't the bad guy after all. Did you know that? Did you yeah. know it, Dan? I had no fucking idea. I like how Proto Man comes to clear his name, like, at this moment. <laughs> yeah, what? Where have you been? Brother. Why does he leave? Yeah, help us out, dude. He's your imposter. Take responsibility. <laughs> this is your imposter. Which means it's your fault. <laughs> <laughs> this reminds me of The Nose by Nikolai Gogol. <laughs> okay. Because in the nose, a man wakes up to find that his nose is missing. And he then he's Mega man. he goes outside, you know, and he finds his nose. And his nose is like a really important official. He's actually a higher oh, rank right. than he is, you know. Uh huh. And that has nothing to do with this imposter story with Proto Man yeah, at all. I, I see what you're talking about. Uh, Proto Man is clearly inferior to this guy. For what reason is he kidnapping Dr. Light, right? I mean, he didn't make any of the robot masters. <laughs> Dr. Wily wants to destroy the world, right? Yeah, yeah, true. So, yeah, Dr. Light is preventing him from doing that. So Dr. Light must die. I mean, he already has captured Dr. Light. Just kill him. <laughs> just kill him already. He just wants to show it to Mega Man that he's going to kill him. I, I guess, I guess one thing too is like, oh shit, I did know, it, Doctor Wily. Oh, you did it! Congratulations! <laughs> I fuck yeah, I guess. And you beat the game. Hell wow, yeah. Dan, good job, buddy. That was the last boss. You've done. You've well, done well, Mega Man. Mega Man. I, I never, expected never expected you to, to defeat, defeat my powerful, powerful Dark Man robot. robot. Until now, until now, I have, have managed, managed to frame, to frame Pro Man, Proto -Man <laughs> for my crimes. But, but now, now the, the real Proto Man, Man has, has appeared and spoiled, and my, spoiled plan. my plan. Doctor Light, Doctor Light is, is a captive, captive in my in lab. my lab. Come, if, Come you dare. if you dare. Ha ha ha! Ha 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 ha! That was awesome. Here you go, Danny. Just what you wanted. A whole nother fortress. Did you guess this was gonna happen? 
Yeah, of course this was gonna happen. I don't know how many stages there are gonna be. Oh my god, four? Yep. So, so we... yeah, like I was saying, like, Wily must have a, you know, the pride, whereas he wants to show Dr. Light that he can take over the world, you know? Probably. So killing him would, yeah. Killing them would kind of defeat the purpose. He wants to show that he's better than Dr. Light. More than anything, probably. More wow. than taking over the world, it's about beating Dr. Light at something. Maybe, but it, wouldn't it just be so much easier if he just killed him? Well, Doc, that doesn't get rid of Mega Man, <laughs> so to speak. Yeah, well, it gets Certainly rid of Mega Man X. He wants to kill Mega Man. I, I, it at least gets rid of Mega Man X, potentially. I don't know, whenever he starts working on, working on Mega Man X, at least. Um, then, in that case... No Mega Man X, he just makes Zero, and he also makes the Sigma Virus, and so he just automatically wins. Well, he basically already wins anyway, right? Not really. It's the it's the offspring of, of Light. Not really the offspring, I guess. Yeah, you're making it sexual, man. Th it's not Does sexual. not need to be. It's not sexual. Offspring. Having an offspring doesn't have to be a, a sexual thing. I think, uh... Actually, the, um, oh. interesting uh, thing about Offspring and Mega Man, um... <laughs> it's an interesting sentence. Uh, but I think... So, Mega Man, uh, .exe, fuck, is a alternate universe, right? Retelling, I suppose, of Mega Man, the original series. Um, and Light, uh, he famously wanted a kid, right? And that's why he made, uh, Rock and Roll. Um, initially. When do I go? Ah! Light wanted a a kid, uh, but he couldn't have any. He couldn't fucking have any, so he built Rock and Roll in the original universe. Why not? Was he just not popular with the ladies? I, or yeah, well, that's like... exactly why. Um, so, in the Rockman.exe universe, uh, the the thing is, is that you play is, the, you play as uh, Light Sun. The main character is Light Sun? Yeah. Uh, well, they go by a slightly different name, but it, it essentially just means light. Uh, in that universe, he goes into AI rather than, uh, robotics. So, pretty much, the the defining factor between whether or not, uh, Rangman.exe happens and, you know, light goes into robotics versus AI, uh, is whether or not light bones or... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Professor Light Bones, um, which is pretty cool. Well, it's just a matter of, you know, having people around to hang out with or not, right? <laughs> I guess. I guess. It's not a matter of having sex, necessarily. Yes, it is! That's his son! You play as his yeah, son. Yeah, but the, th the whole thing is, it's like, this Dr. Light is lonely, so he has to build companions, right? Yeah, and this Dr. Light, fuck it, has fucks! He fucks! Dr. Light fucks! Mega Man.exe light fucks, and that's no, why. No, no, no. It's not. It's not a matter of just having sex. It's a matter of having companionship. You're just a broken right? record, dude. He fucks. You're you're going past the point. You're saying dude. the same thing over and over again. Listen, I'm I'm not beating around the bush like you are. He fucks in that universe. He has intercourse in that universe. Universe. He has it. That's why you suck at this game, Dan. You don't have a pure heart like Mega Man. <laughs> you don't have intercourse. The thing is, dude, is that, uh, I mean, if this Dr. Light wanted to have intercourse, I'm certain he could. I'm certain there's some, He's like, old. He can't whorehouse do it. he could go. <laughs> he doesn't want to do the, the robo the whorehouse. <laughs> <laughs> robo whore. He can make He's his own so robo whore. I think you can actually stand under that thing that you've kind of randomly died on before. Well, I randomly died on it, so now I don't trust it. You gotta trust it. I can't trust it. If you have trust issues, you'll never have a companion, Dan. And you'll be like Dr. Light, and you'll have to make robots. <laughs> oh, that's pretty cool. Oh, fuck! <laughs> First boss of the Wily stages. What the fuck happens in Wily stages? I've seen you before! This is this was in an ABGN episode. Yes. I don't really want to do this whole no, stage again. I say, I say each video should be at most an hour long, or like break it up into two different episodes or something. But 
God yeah, damn. just the highlights. Just the highlights. Fuck, dude. Okay, I don't want to talk about the goddamn highlights right now. Fuck this guy. Whoa. And also, you're trying to hit him twice like that, which also often ends up having you land on the spike. But you got it this time. Whoa, you did it. It doesn't feel like it. There we go. Did it on your last S arrow. <sighs> Just keep those flaps always closed, dude. And Mega Man cannot defeat what you. What do I? I can't even defeat him with his flaps open, dude. I don't understand this guy at all. He just like comes flying at me, but at that point, what do I do? Think about it. He hums in on you. So what you gotta do is be up high and then get down low like that. Slide under. Man, you gotta do the basic song. <sighs> God damn it. Okay, here's the basic fucking you gotta be song, patient. bro. Here's the basic be song. Be patient. Here's the basic fucking patient. song. Here it is. Here it is. Okay, he hits me. He goes over here. He hits me. <laughs> he fucking hits me. He's got my balls cannon. Yeah. There's no point than uh, than to stand on these platforms, because... Exactly. They're just there to confuse you. See? You played the basic song, and now you're getting it. Right? What'd I tell you? There you go! Yes! Okay, he was easy. Turns all out. right. Yeah, right? They're all, right. all easy if you figure them out. They're all easy. Oh, it's been- it's what you've been waiting for. Oh, shit. No! Hey, you did it! Look how far you've come. All right, all right. Who's fucking next? All right, try to guess who's in each capsule. So, all right, let's make, let's make a bet. Let's make a bet. Or not charge? Yeah, charge man. Why is charge man here? Wasn't charge man like bottom? It's kind of random, over I think. Here? Gravity man. All right, that's stone man. Ah. Oh. All right, it's two down. I bet this next one is. Uh... Stone Man! Gravity Crap, Man! <laughs> didn't even get to guess. That was a nice kill. Thanks, man. Fuck yeah. Stone Man. Uh, Chef Boyard. Stone Man! Fuck you, dude. He never got to see a movie. <laughs> Never. Very sad. So sad. What a sad ending. I'm saying that's, uh, hang on. Let me guess. Let me guess. Napalm Man. Napalm Man? Oh shit, I gotta fight yeah. Napalm Man again? Ah. Okay. Um, Star Man. <laughs> wow. Damn. Thanks for the easy fucking man, kill, getting... Gravity Man. He was. That's not Gravity Man. Star Man. Stone. Start. Star Man. Napalm Man. This is Gyro Man. Napalm Man. Got one right. Finally. Go fuck yourself! Whoa! Gyro Man, then. I remember Gyro Man. I remember getting decent at him. Uh, right? Kind of. Use the gravity hold, right? Right, 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 right. Remember, you gotta be patient with this guy. Wait for your opening. Okay. <laughs> Poor Gyro Man. Damn, Gyro Man. Poor Gyro Man. <laughs> Alright. Let's kick him. That's right. Oh, shit. Boss time. It's not that what hard. What is he thinking? What is he thinking? What the fuck, dude? I've literally just stood here. It can't kill you. Oh my god. Is it that hard? Wily. Oh shit! <laughs> he did it! He did it! He tricked us. He made you careless. Oh! 
Fuck you, Wily. Bye bye, Wily. Bye bye, Wily. All right, here we go. This could be it. The last boss. All right. Careful. He has a vacuum. Damn, Wily. Oh, we shit. have vacuum technology. <laughs> You're not going to use his weakness? You're going to mega buster him to death? What the fuck is his weakness? You got to figure Wiley, it out. Bro. His motherfucking He has a weakness. Wiley. Every Wily has a weakness. It's got to be the Are you end trying bomb. the super arrow? Can't be the end bomb. That's what I think it is. No. Usually speaking, it. It is something inconvenient to hit him with, with Wily's case. It is something inconvenient. Usually. <laughs> what if it was? Well, it is! It is! <laughs> what? Oh my god. Super arrow. Suck on this. My arrow! I guess because they both suck. <laughs> Probably. Wily's fucking dead. Just kidding. Oh man, this. Hey, you could say you busted only the last boss. Well, <laughs> not like I had a choice. Second form. See, he's pretty easy. He's extremely easy. Is this really how that game's gonna fucking end? Oh, shit. By the way, if you want a deeper understanding of the Mega Man lore, I highly recommend Ben Saint's lecture covering the entire mainline series, which, in an incredible turn of events, came out just as I began planning this series, uh, and that video came in very helpful. Uh, I do suggest you watch it. There are some key points that Ben uh, mentions that I bring up pretty frequently or reiterate or kind of just touch upon. Uh, also, this pause bit was basically directly inspired by that video. So please check it out when you get a chance or watch it in tandem with our series. Uh, I think really immersing yourself in the series is the way to go for sure. So please give it your all. Uh, Ganbare. Ganbare. Just come somewhere I can hit you, dude. Oh my god. Use your motherfucking tank. Wow. Motherfucking tank! Let's motherfucking go. All right, Wily, I use my motherfuck. Are you ready? I hate whenever they eventually gave Mega Man a voice and he sounded like a stupid baby. He should have sounded fucking awesome, like, Wily, I'm gonna fucking kill you. <laughs> Here it is, the moment of truth. Yeah! Truth! Oh, baby! Fuck you, Wily! Suck my mega dick! Look at his shitty feet. Fuck yeah, dude. That's Mega Man 5. Yo, what's up, Dr. Light? <laughs> I got you from the cage. Been hanging out in the cage this whole time. Oh shit, we're oh, gonna crap. fucking die! Oh! He escaped! Oh no. This is the end of Mega Man. <gasps> Who could that be? Holy shit. Wow. Damn. What Pretty the fuck cool did he do? I <laughs> wish you did that on the fucking bosses, dude. Use Why can't you do C4. that in any other game? Look at him in the corner. <laughs> he just ducks just, out. Uh, ducks away. Alright, I'm gonna duck out of here now. Alright then. Congratulations. The first one. The first stepping stone. Ugh. So how did you feel? How that, do you feel now? Uh, people talk about two and three and six. You know. I talk about six. I think people talk about I six thought, a lot. I think six is like generally considered 
you know, one of the weaker entries. Like, oh, really? Everyone says that, uh... Maybe that's why they talk one about One and it. six. <laughs> one and six are, like, the kind of polarizing entries, oh. you know? I like all of them, though. I like- I enjoy all of them. This one, I think, is, uh, a really good pick-up-and-play Mega Man game. It's not too frustrating. It's a fun time, I think, the whole way through. So, where are we headed next, Dan? Alright, I think- What Mega Man do you want to- I think I've decided, um, the next Mega Man I want to Mega do is Mega Man 4. So you're gonna do 4 and 6. 4, 6, and then 3, 2, 1. It's gonna be stupid, <laughs> but it's, that's how we're doing it. Well, I mean, I'm surprised I made it this far. Enough King! Hey, baby. There's Beat. Got to see him. There he is. He's like, you got, you could have kicked some ass with me, <laughs> but whatever. So, yeah. I guess we'll see you in a later Mega Man game. Maybe, beat. maybe another time, Beat. Uh, yeah. Thanks for showing me how to play Mega Man. Well, I, I think I deserve a break, <laughs> but we'll be back soon enough to play some more goddamn Mega Man. All right, one down. Ten more to go. Red-headed Red.